Hey guys, it's Mark Savard here uh, with my assistant Summer. We just finished the show tonight. Something very strange, very cool, very unique kind of happened. And uh, yeah, tell them, tell us about it. Um, we had a volunteer on stage tonight. Um, his name was David, and he had a speech impediment. Um, he stuttered. Uh, Mark went to uh, introduce him and um, noticed that he had a stutter and helped him out. It's very cool. Here's the footage. I uh, hope you enjoy. Your name? Josie. Josie, nice to have you here. Kim and Josie tonight, make some noise. Okay, <laughs> yours. Kim. Kim, hi Kim, nice to meet you. Kim with Kim tonight, make some noise. Okay, so Kim, Josie, Frank, uh, Derek, and yours again was? Hmm? Bree, how could I forget? Good to have you here, Bree, okay. <laughs> Excellent, good. Your name? I, I don't have a speech impediment. I'm, I'm the D D D D V. David, okay, good. Let me help you with that right now. Just breathe in real deep and let your body slip deep. <sighs> conscious mind's getting away with the subconscious mind in uh, getting those words out. So just let the subconscious mind do its work. You'll see it's a lot easier and a lot freer. Eyes open. And your name again? I'm David. Good. Nice to meet you. Who came with David tonight? Make some noise. Who's with David? Good. Tamika, what is it you do? I manage a financial institution. Great. And where are you from? St. Louis. St. Louis. I like St. Louis. Good to have you here. Come on up, sweet. David, what is it you do, sir? What do you do for a living? I am an evangelist at a church. Evangelist at a church. Great. And where are you from? I'm Glendale, Arizona. Glendale. That's where I, that's where I took my hypnotherapy training. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> I, I really like that uh, the speech thing's good, right? It really helps it out a lot. Yeah. Good. How long have you had a speech impediment? My whole life. Yeah, not anymore. You can get rid of that easy, just like that. Let the subconscious mind do its thing. You impressed? It's all your work, man. It happens in your mind. What about you, what do you do? Yeah, sure, you show your appreciation. Yeah. Yeah, I'll tell you why that is. The subconscious mind, when you're talking about something comfortable or when you're in your position or whatever, it just flows and you can say what you do, especially when you have, you know, sermons or whatever, it just comes out, right? But the moment you get in a situation where the anxiety comes in, that's conscious mind. And the conscious mind inhibits subconscious activity. They don't work well together. So being able to turn that part of your brain off allows the subconscious mind to just let those ideas flow. And you have control of it even though you think you don't because you consciously don't, but the subconscious mind can override that. You just have to not get in the way of it. Everybody here wants to know what you have to say. So it's important that you share it without getting in the way of yourself doing it. And now that that's happened, there's a new association, I think you're gonna find and surprise yourself dramatically. Good, all right. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. Now if you're thinking about subscribing to my channel, you could do that by clicking here. If you're thinking about watching last week's video, You could do that by clicking here. Oh, the more you clap, the faster. Thanks, and we'll see you soon.